Greg Cook. What do you think? <laughs> 42. 42, you're 10 years off. I'm the CEO and co-founder of the Stone Brewing Company and Stone Brewing World Beast Road Gardens. Uh, years, uh, it's uh, 20 years. No, Stone is the only brewery I have worked in. My favorite color is gray. I don't want to commit. I love so many. Delicious. Uh, so, Cantillon, I visited Cantillon for the first time in 1995. I definitely love Cantillon. Um, I, uh, I've, I visited uh, a Nepa beer here in Barcelona last night. That was really awesome. It was very good. I was at Black Lab earlier today. They make very delicious beers. Okay, that was three. Yes, I have uh, uh, about 300 favorite American breweries. This was supposed to be quick question, quick answer. This isn't a quick Mars. <laughs> I think on Mars, I would like a uh, hoppy saison. Okay. But really kind of funky. Funky at the same time. Definitely Brett. Okay. Brett and Mars is uh, the combination you want. Uh, pros. Uh, Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell. Um, an American werewolf in London. It's moving. It's circling us. Ah, oh, fuck. What's the plan? Plan? Let's just keep walking. Uh, there was a background music for something I, uh, I saw recently. It was Ballroom Blitz by... Ballroom Blitz by Sweet. Sweet, right? I think it was Sweet. Right now, I'm liking Deadpool. <laughs> Deadpool. I think Marco Polo. I think um, Day After Tomorrow. My father. I believe it exists, um, but I think we make our own luck, mostly. Uh, Spanish craft beer has been, uh, I've had tens. Ten? I've had some tens, yes. I don't know every Spanish craft beer because I haven't had them, but I've had some. I've had some that qualified for lower than ten, but I've had some that I thought were fucking awesome. We have um, the Stone 20th Anniversary Celebration and Invitational Beer Festival this summer, August 20th. Uh, in San Diego, uh, and you're all invited. I had this um, Berliner Weisse today from uh, Black Lab, but that I thought was really great. They called it Sour Lady, and it uh, was a very good Berliner Weisse. Um, I had a uh, uh, an IPA at um, Beer Cab from Napa Beer last night. I'm trying to remember the name. It was really, really good. Which one? Hop Doom. Hop Doom? No, it wasn't Acre. Is it Hop Doom? It was not Hop Doom. It was um, Insider. Insider, thank you. Insider, yeah. That was, that was really good.
Um, we were talking about Orval earlier. Oh, you said Spanish. Spanish. Or, no, no, not, not Spanish. Oh, okay. Uh, I love Orval. Uh, and then I love uh, Alesmith. Their 395 Pale L is just really, really good. Uh, was that five? I can keep going. I can keep going for about another three hours. Uh, just two more. Okay, just two more. Only two more. I'm trying to think of something, you know, really kind of uh, unique. Uh, uh, what is it? It's um, there's a Goza from uh, Freigeist. Freigeist, a small brewery in Cologne, and he makes a um, a, uh, a, ra- a rhubarb rhubarb Goza. I think is is really quite. Quite lovely. Hippie, grunge, or hipster? Me? I've been called everything. So yeah, we just finished. We have a beer uh, to say cheers. Just to represent. Was easy. No, some of those questions weren't easy. Some of the questions were difficult. How would you answer that question? What is your favorite beer? So what about the gargles of stone? Will be seduced by the evil in the future or not? Seduced? No. Uh, gargoyles are protectors. They ward off evil spirits. They cannot be seduced. They are steadfast and resolute. Okay. What is and your... I am too. Because if I am, I'm nothing if I'm not stubborn. And I am not interested in the big companies buying us not interested that's not why I did this I did this because of passion and my belief in craft beer and I'm not gonna sell that out 